hello everyone so in this video we are going to see the synchron interview questions so we would be looking at the questions along with the answers for test automation experienced qa interview questions at synchron okay so let us look at the questions one by one so first question which is usually asked is what is system.out.println why are we using this so system.out.println is used to print the every output to the new line and in that they will also ask you what each individual this thing means like system out and print and so system is a class in the java.lang package out is a static member of the system class and is an instance of java.io now print stream so print ln is a method of java itself and uh, over here it is nothing but a method of java.io.print stream okay so this method is overloaded to print message to the output destination okay so this is the explanation of why are we using this and what is system.out.print now what is web driver which all abstract methods are there in the web driver so we all know web driver is an interface so most of the commonly used methods of web driver are abstract so here is a list get get current url get title find elements find element get page source close quit so these are all the abstract methods which are there in the web driver itself now write a java program to generate fibonacci series so please ignore this spell mistake over here so fibonacci series is uh, nothing but you know it can be the code can be written in a, a c language c++ and other things but over here it is specifically mentioned that it needs to be written in the java language so we have used the scanner and uh, within the main method we have initialized uh, four variables one is n then a b and c and then using the uh, for loop basically we can get this fibonacci series printing so you can go through this program okay and if any any questions are there it is a basically very simple program and if any questions are there feel free to put in the description of this youtube video in the comment section of the youtube video video what is base class of exception so the java.lang.throwable class is a root cl root class of java exception hierarchy okay so it has got it is inherited by two subclasses one is exception and another is error okay. now the hierarchy of java exception classes are again given below that is one is compile time exception and another is runtime exception so basically you have to provide these uh, details whenever you are asking whenever someone asks you about these exceptions now why we use finally block or what is finally block now finally block is nothing but it is used to execute important code such as closing connection stream etc it is always executed whether exception is handled or not so many of us they get confused that whether finally would be getting executed during this true condition or during false condition but the reason but the answer is that it will always get executed whenever exception is handled or not now what is the difference between checked and unchecked exception so these are two types of exceptions now checked exceptions are the ones that is input output exception or you might get sql exception okay they are checked at the compile time and they are they are inherited from throwable classes okay except the runtime exception and the error now unchecked exceptions are not checked at the compile time but they are checked at the runtime okay so this is the major difference between the two exceptions and the classes which inherit runtime exception are known as unchecked exceptions so arithmetic exception null pointer exception array index out of bounds exception so these are the examples of unchecked exception and for checked exception you have got examples such as io exception sql exception these are all the exceptions for examples for checked exception okay so this is one of the manual testing question which is majorly asked sorry i brought it to you over here so what is the difference between sanity and smoke testing so we all know smoke testing is nothing but it is a build verification test performed on a particular build while uh, uh, sanity testing is also called as tester acceptance testing or it is a detailed level of testing while smoke testing is just the testing on the uh, upper areas of the application while sanity testing is the deep testing thank you for watching this video if you have any uh, interview questions that you have come across while giving the job interviews in very various companies please share those questions with us at rd automation learning 
at gmail.com so we can share ahead with the community and thank you for watching this video stay tuned for more updates thank you